hello guys in this video we will solve this question that is if x1 and x2 are roots of quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 where c is not equal to 0 find the value of ax1 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 plus ax2 plus b to the power of minus 2 in terms of a b and c question says that x1 and x2 are roots of this equation then we need to find the value of this in terms of a comma b comma c as the question says x1 and x2 are roots therefore x1 and x2 must satisfy this equation therefore on on substituting x1 and x2 in the equation ax square plus bx plus c we will get ax1 square plus bx1 plus c is equal to 0 and the second will be ax2 square plus bx2 plus c is equal to 0 so from 1 basically the the question says to find the value of a1 plus b whole to the power of minus 2 therefore uh, therefore from this we need to get a1 plus b whole to the power of minus 2 to get that firstly we send c to the firstly we send a x1 square plus b x1 to the right hand side we will get this and from this we take minus x1 as common to get a x1 plus b the here in the question as you can see the question says a x1 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 so to get a raised to the power of minus 2 we do squaring on both the sides we will get a we will get c square divided by a x1 square is equal to a a x1 plus b whole square the question says raised to the power of mum raised to the power of minus 2 therefore we reciprocal this to get a x1 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 is equal to x1 square divided by c square so finally we got a x1 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 is equal to x1 square divided by c square. Now similarly we apply this process by equation by taking equation 2. Firstly we solve by taking equation 1 and we got this. Similarly we do this similar process by taking equation 2. Therefore, from by solving this, by doing this similar process for equation 2, we will get a2 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 is equal to x2 square divided by c2. So as, as question says, we need to find the sum of this. We got these two values. The first is this one and the second is this one and the left is we need to sum these two values therefore we here we sum these two values that is a x1 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 plus a x2 plus b raised to the power of minus 2 so the value of first will be x1 square divided by c square plus the second will be x2 square divided by c2 square the de denominators are common therefore we take common therefore we get numerator as x1 square plus x2 square therefore as you know x1 and x2 are roots the question says we need to find this in terms of a b and c but we got this in terms of x1 and x2 and c therefore we convert this x1 square plus x2 square as 
एक्स वन प्लस एक्स टू होल स्क्वायर माइनस टू एक्स वन एक्स टू सी स्क्वायर सी स्क्वायर विल बी एज इट इज वी गॉट एक्स वन स्क्वायर प्लस एक्स टू स्क्वायर लाइक दिस So we can write x one plus x two whole square as x one plus x two whole square minus two x one x two. From this, as you can see, if alpha, uh, as you know, alpha plus beta whole square is alpha square plus beta square plus two alpha beta. We send two alpha beta to left hand side. We will get alpha square plus beta square as alpha plus beta whole square minus two alpha beta. Similarly. In the place of alpha beta, we have x one and x two. Therefore, the value of x one square plus x two square will be this. As we know that x one and x two are the roots, therefore the sum of roots is minus b by a, and the product is c by a. Therefore, the answer will be b square divided by a square minus two into c by a. And the denominator c square will be as it is. On taking LCM from this both, we will get b square minus two ac whole divided by c square. On sending c square, the c square will come here. The c square will be multiplied to a square. Therefore, b square minus two ac divided by a c square. Basically, this will follow. If if we have a by b divided by c by d, then we will get d will be sent d will be multiplied to a and c will be multiplied to b. Therefore, we get a d divided by c d. Therefore, this only have done clear. This is minus one. Therefore, we send one to the Top one that 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 is b square minus two ac, and we send c square to the this value. The final answer will be two b square minus four ac divided by a square into c square. Therefore, the question says we need to find the value in terms of a, b, and c. We finally got the value in terms of a, b, and c. Thank you guys thank you for watching my video